The Marcos camp wants the Supreme Court to dismiss the counter-protest of Vice President Lenny Robredo over his electoral protest. This after Mrs. Robredo's failure to pay the first tranche of processing fee with the Presidential Electoral Tribunal, or PET. But just when former Senator Bongbong Marcos was about to turn the table in his rival over money issues, the Vice President was quick to react. Marami pang kautangan sa bayan na hindi pa nababayaran. At yung, yung kautangan na yun, yun din yung ginagamit para makabalit sa kapangyarihan. Marcos recently paid over 36 million pesos with the PET to fund the poll recount in 27 provinces. Tapos na yung eleksyon, tingin ko alam niya naman na hindi siya nadaya. Tingin ko alam niya naman yun. Pero yung desire, desire na makabalit sa kapangyarihan. Marcus filed an electoral protest on June 29, 2016, contesting election results from some 39,000 precincts in 25 provinces and cities. But Robredo, who won by a margin of more than 260,000 votes against Marcus, maintains she won in clean and honest elections, and she is not allowing the return of the Marcuses to power. One of the reasons why I to was also because of an impending Marcos return. Ivy Saunar, CNN Philippines.